Alright guys, this is my battlefield I made a while ago. Just want to show it to you. Um, up here I have a couple dead Cadians that fought, like died, I guess. Yeah, they died in battle. I have uh, a little wall. Another Cadian. Then over here on this side, we have dead Tyranids everywhere. I guess there was a big battle between the Tyranids and the Cadians. Um, over here on this part, we have a couple dead Eldar laying there with their guns all over. Um, not the best I've ever made, but I wanted to. I really want like a Warhammer scenery table. You know, when you'll have like a big table and you'll have hills and valleys and like basically a permanent setup. Well, I always wanted one of those, but I didn't. So this is the closest thing I came to. Just to show you how big it is, here's an orc truck. Uh, so it's like pretty big, maybe a foot by a foot. Um, some other things I have. I built this wall, just a normal foam wall on a cardboard base. My grandpa, he has a train set, and he has lots of train pieces for making his train set. So I found these two pieces of random wall and just glued them together and then glued them onto the space. I guess it's kind of cheating because they were already made, but no, it's pretty good. Uh, I built this. This is my first building I ever made. It's kind of crappy. It's uh, supposed to use the rust look that Mini War Gaming showed me. I didn't do it very well, but anyway, thanks Mini War Gaming because it made it a little better. Um, up here on the top, there's all these little walls that kind of protect it from enemies. Uh, so it's basically like a little shack hovel thing. Uh, I think that's all. Hold on. Let me see if I have anything else over here. Um, yeah, I got a couple more things over here. I can show you. Uh, I've got some fence. I've got some fence. It's like um, just a normal fence. Here's the space machine to show you how big it is. I learned this te technique from Kibbles twelve twelve. Kibbles 1212, if you look under my subscriptions, he's there. He has some really good ideas. Basically, what you do is you take, uh, pop you need four popsicle sticks. You cut it into three three-centimeter pieces and glue them together for each fence post. And then you take the other ones and cut off the round edges and just glue them on. That makes a nice little fence. I just did a double one here. Um, I'll give a tutorial on making that later. Uh... If you guys leave any comments for any other videos I should do, I will. Uh, thanks.